Sim Gill says three lives were lost all because of a $2,400 drug debt. One of the victims wasn't even an intended target. 22 months after their disappearance, victims Rocio Bustamante, Carlos Sepulveda, and Zamir Sanchez may finally be a step closer to justice. And they were uh, kidnapped and in the process of that kidnapping, uh, ultimately murdered up in the mountains. On Wednesday, Salt Lake County District Attorney Sim Gill announced six first-degree felony charges against Cesar Matias Sevilla Aleman. You may recognize his name from a shooting at Utah Lake in September 2022. That unrelated event happened after the alleged Tuila murders, and he's currently in prison serving time for it. On the night in question that he had come back and uh, had talked about how they had shot and uh, uh, murdered somebody, uh, some people and buried them up in the hills. A witness told investigators they allegedly overheard Sevilla Aleman say that they, quote, dug the hole for the men and the woman was not supposed to be there. And it was just uh, happened that she was got caught up in this. Her mother reported her missing and the other two men were reported a few weeks later. That somebody had called her and said, stop looking for her that she had been killed and had been buried up in the mountains. It wasn't until April 2023 when training cadaver dogs found their bodies near the Muirker trailhead. Gill says it took this long to press charges because investigators had lots of witness statements and cell phone location records to connect the case. It, when you talk about it in dollars and cents, there that's just money. It's not, it's, it can, can never rationalize the loss of human life. Of the six charges that he faces, three are aggravated murder and three are for aggravated kidnapping. Reporting outside the Salt Lake County District Attorney's Office, Emily Tensor, Fox 13 News, Utah.